In this video, we're going to be looking on how to build our left brain power part two, that is using alphabetics and alphabetics are like children of crosswords. I shouldn't say children, they are, they resemble a crossword, but it has one unique feature that makes it even more interesting. And we're starting right now. Hey, this is Advait. Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to learn how you can build your memory, build your brain by uncovering fascinating facts and clear academic concepts, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss any of our videos. So now let's jump over to the presentation I've prepared. So now let us look at how to build our left brain power to that is alphabetics. It is quite a unique puzzle. So let's get on. So what are alphabetics? Again, Alphabetics are crossword puzzles in which we use all 26 letters of the English alphabet but each letter is used only once. The process of elimination helps it solve a little bit easier than classical crosswords. So this is exactly like classical crosswords that you have solved in many puzzle books. But what is unique about alphabetics is that all the letters, all the 26 letters of the English alphabet are used only once without repetition so from a to z a to z all the letters that are in the english alphabets are used only once without repetition so it makes it a very fun and easy puzzle to solve for building a left brain power it is a little bit easier because the process of elimination because we know that a b c d or some other words which are already done are done so it may it should not get repeated so the word is constituted with letters other than a b c d or other than the words that are already in the crossword so that is the process of elimination so now let us look at one example to make a clear picture in your head on what are alphabetics an example so if you can see in this a b c d e all the letters of the english alphabet are there and they are written only once and it is typical it is like crosswords it is simple you got clues for down across it is exactly the same but all the letters are used only once so i'll be giving you three alphabetics so i would recommend you to pause the video after i show the and alphabetics and the clue and try solving them on your own so i'll be giving you some hints on how to solve or the tips to solve or from where to start after i tell you to pause the video after each and every alphabetics so if you're not able to solve this uh, alphabetic on your own you can use that hints and then solve then we will discuss the answers so now let's get on so now let's move on to alphabetics one right now alphabetics one here is the grid Here's the across clues and the down clues. So I'll read out for you the across clues. Either side of a door opening, not a lot. Frank Baum country, rapid and Sharon's waterway. Downwards, ferret's foot, sudden start, James name that was often his name. Dash horse Larry Lee and with C in Latin. So pause the video right now. You need GK, you need English vocabulary to solve this. So pause the video and let's get on to the first hint I'm going to be giving you. I'll be giving you two hints for this alphabetic. So the hint one is that four across and seven across and six down are good starter points because they are pretty much easy to solve. If you continue playing it, I'll give you the hint two as well. So if you want to pause the video and if you got the starters then let's solve it so now for the hint number two so i'll be giving you one answer of either side of door opening two across is jamb so j a m b so jamb is the word and now i'm not be giving you any more hints after this we will be solving this as a whole so at least pause the video right now and try solving the other eliminate and solve it so now let's solve this alphabetics if you're not able to solve it is okay this is the first one okay don't get disheartened so we we'll look at ferret's food one down is answer is paw you need general knowledge as i told you before four not a lot obviously few is the correct word yep let's go by three down three down is james name uh, james, james bond often his name bond james bond pardon my handwriting again so bond 
So five across is Frank Baum country, Aussie, Australia. So let's look at seven. Seven across is rapid. Rapid answer should be quick, I guess. Let's put that. It's temporary. Okay, we can erase it. But I think it's correct. Let's go. So two down is sudden start. It's obviously jerk. Right? Sudden jerk. Not that jerk. Not that silly jerk. Okay. So six down is dash horse diary. I'm not sure. Yep. I'm not sure. Let's go to seven down with C. Q E. Yep. So light horse Larry yeah correct yeah that's what uh light horse Larry so now let's eliminate because I have no idea on what is Sharon's waterway I can see that s is missing y and x s y x so that will be sticks I don't know if you know what is sticks or what is Sharon's waterway let me know down in the comments okay I want to build my general knowledge as well so this is the solution to the alphabetics even if you didn't get it don't feel disheartened let's move on to the second alphabetic so let's go down here's the grid here's the cross and the down clues so game board area abbreviation plat do dash 30 hyphen 3 hyphen 30 mc example it's an example gaudy or flashy in a slangy way AC up okay annoy and public proclamation or prohibit down bots partner stimulate what for okay Navy lieutenants ranking football lineman abbreviation unscrupulous flirt okay so you know pause the video right now and try solving the alphabetic so there's only one hint that I will be giving for you in this particular analog so what is the hint is that it's seven across gaudy or flashy the answer is glitzy okay so g l i t z y so now you can pause the video again and try solving the rest of the alphabetic so i hope you you know solve this alphabetic let's get on this is a bit tricky so three down uh what for what for why why means what for it means the same correct yep why six across is 330 mc uh hf hf okay let's get on to stimulate stimulate q quicken quicken is the correct option sorry correct word yep Again, pardon my handwriting. Uh, one across is game board area abbreviation. Uh, SQ. <laughs> yeah, kids, right? Okay. One down, bots partner. Uh, bots partner. We buy something that's bots. Bots partner. That means it's not the opposite. It should be a synonym. Sold yes so yeah yeah it definitely builds your iq as well yeah so if you want to build your iq also this is one very pretty good one okay so uh four across plat do jor it's i don't know it's some maxim no i don't know okay five down is over let's look at nine across annoy you are vexed Yep, wax. Wax is the correct word. Nine down. So nine across is over. Nine down is unscrupulous foot. No idea. Ten across pro public proclamation or prohibit. You're publicly prohibiting. That means you're publicly banning something. So ban is the correct word. So what is missing here? M is missing and P okay vamp okay so vamp means unscrupulous flirt okay 
I had no idea. So this was the answer of alphabetics 2. Let's get on to alphabetics 3. Here's the grid. This is the final alphabetics. So pause the video right now and try solving this last alphabetics. So now I'll give you a hint and I will solve you 8 down. It is pretty confusing. Turkish topper is Fez. F -E F-E-Z. Okay, so now pause the video again, eliminate, and it's this is one that's pretty easy. Okay, so let's get on. So I hope you have solved alphabet X3. Let's get on and solve this. So cricket action. Uh okay, two across. Bat is not so another one is ball. So ball bowling, yep, correct. Pledge or pickle one down. Okay, okay, it's something. Yokes on him, ox. Yokes on him, ox. Okay. Four down is charlatan. Mm -hmm. TV spot seven across. Obviously, add. Yep. Eighty. Uh. So six down. Address abbreviation. Address abbreviation. Uh, should be. I don't know. Let's see. Fire across is harm or damage injury. Injury. Okay. So six down is already over. Four across. Four down. Okay. Charlatan. Mm, I'm getting it. Four down, charlatan, quack. Mm -hmm. Quack, yes. <laughs> and I think so, this should be a dark one. Okay, there's nothing over here. So let this be dark, okay? This is shaded area. Sorry that. Uh, <laughs> so nine is entertainment host. Oh my god. One down, I think I'm getting it as plight. Yep. Plight is the correct one. Ten across sleeveless garment vest. So there's only one letter missing right now. I have to find figure out and it's M M C. So we have solved three alphabetics. So if you are if you are able to solve these alphabetics well, you are on that line. And if you are able to solve these pretty easily, then I would recommend you to, you know try composing an alphabetic it's actually difficult as i told you in the analogs episode composing something is a bit difficult and it's always challenging so if you are able to compose a successful alphabetics then congratulations your left brain has surpassed level two now that your left brain has surpassed level two it's time for level three and i've linked to the playlist in the screen right now and if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do that as well if you're enjoying this series let me know down in the comments also thank you so much for watching i'll see you next time